Right, okay, fuck it. We're officially, officially, officially uh, going to give up on Flight Simulator. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that was kind of non-ideal. Um, the thing is, for the most part, other than when we were really close to the ground, for the most part, everything actually worked quite well. A couple of frame rate issues here and, and there. But it just kept causing the computer to crash. Two crashes in one stream is just a wee bit unreasonable. Um, so, yeah, sorry about that one. Uh, I think maybe one day when um, I get around to getting a better... Um, <clears throat> A better graphics card because uh, my graphics card is pretty good but um, it's old um, so yeah even with uh, even with liquid cooling on it it still obviously it wasn't enough for glorious glorious success so um, yeah so, so with that in mind um, we're gonna do a little bit of overcrowd to close out the stream well, it's been a little bit of a... Um, <clears throat> yeah, we've, we've had a little bit of a bad time today, I think. Um, okay, so... I'm just trying to remember what we all had with this here platform. Um, ah, yes, the glorious, glorious advertising wall. Yeah, so basically, we're on a mission to try and five-star all of our train stations. Um... <clears throat> First thing that we can do in terms of tasks is um, to start getting rid of some of the old ways of generating electricity. May. So, sell so you, 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 you. Uh, right, okay, so we're going to move to here and build utilities build a substation here we go so one of you in here one of you in here and then let's sell this and then we'll grab one more substation sell Have you got shit in them? Uh, yeah, you kind of do. Um, right, okay, so um, if we go to a level 3 Hualabin. Actually, we do have a lot of space here, don't we? Um, yeah, okay. Um, and we will try and. Actually, no, I might just put it elsewhere. Um, So what's that done for our power? Yeah, okay, so we're now generating a metric fuck ton of power, which is all pretty good. Uh, so I now need to try and work out what, um, yeah, okay, so this is like a waste here. It's a morning time. Right, so basically by, yeah, okay, that one's done, that, this one's done, let's just get rid of all of these for the now. Um, so I think we'll need to put some capacitors in uh, and some more really bins. So basically the reason that we're starting off with the utilities is the less money that we are spending on utilities uh, less money that we have to spend on utilities the uh, Uh, because we're going to put in a 
Um, air conditioning, because we don't want the station getting hot. Yeah, so we, we need money for um, this all to be successful. Um, and oil is actually, unsurprisingly, quite expensive, as well as being quite inefficient. How is that doing for our... Uh, right, so what we're going to do is we're going to slap in some wheelie bins in here, uh, as well as an air con. We're going to grab one more substation. I think anything more than that is probably just going to be a wee bit too unnecessary. Uh, happiest of Sundays, everybody! Hey, Willow, how's it going? Um... Why are you telling me there's a train available? Shouldn't you be on automatic? Actually, I don't care. I don't care. Um, yeah, so by providing more freely bins here, that should hopefully allow the station, uh, another place for our staff to sort the station just a little bit easier. Uh, and we need, um, we're gonna, we're gonna grab another capacitor, but I don't think it's too necessary. Um, Power output, yeah, okay, fine. We're absolutely Gucci for power. Okay, fine. So basically, that little exercise um, has completely removed our dependence on oil, um, which is pretty good. Oh, oh, thief noises. Bad touch. Um, can I tell you to get rid of the thing that you're carrying? I think what we need you to do, right, so let's send Mally home for the day. Uh, Mally should be uh, off shift. And you should be off shift. So that should put the things back, which means we can now sell the oil and sell the other oil. So basically, now that there is no need to refill generators, um, there is no need to have the oil canisters to make it necessary to sell said, uh, to fill said generators, um, which is pretty good. So uh, we'll then go uh, and get all these people back on shift. And happy days. We're absolutely sorted. Great. So that gives us space for more tools should they be required. I can't remember if they're required, but we'll find out later. Doing great, my friend. Glad to finally catch one of your streams finally. Well, uh, good that you've joined now because I'm going to be honest with you, Chief. It's been a little bit of a shit show today. Um, oh, I'm having a bad time. Um, yeah, we've 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 had a, a little bit of a rough one, uh, unfortunately. But um, yeah, it's fine. I think. I think now that we've gone to a game that uh, we know only crashes every now and again, as opposed to all the fucking time, um, we're probably not too bad, question mark? Um, this station actually isn't great for upping the commerce. Oh, a brute has entered the station. Is he going to punch shit? I bet he is. I bet he is. Okay, so basically our remaining objectives is um, to um, get this final platform sorted uh, over here and to five star this place, which I, I think we've kind of done actually given that we're hard locked at 100%. So I was going to start upgrading things in order to get more money, but I don't actually think that's going to be now. Oh, well, this kid passed clean the fuck out. Oh, and somebody else just got punched clean the fuck out. Mm -hmm. Okay, problematic. Uh, right, what's this red bar? Oh, that's bins, so the bins, the bins getting full. I still absolutely maintain that the, the level two bin looks a lot better than the fat chungus uh, level three bin, which is just the chug of bins. It's short and chubby. Nice little short train station. Um, I've never heard of this, but it looks like something I'd be into. Yeah, it's um, pretty good to be fair. Um, okay, can somebody please pick up a taser and get rid of this brute who's just punching fuck out of people? Please. Uh, 
Uh, right. So let's just go ahead. So this, as a minimum, is going to be this train station here. I wonder if we try and make a little... Actually, no, that's going to be quite difficult to do, isn't it? Uh, I would... Yeah, okay, no, that's fine. That makes sense. Um... So, how many tiles have we got here? So we've got... Yeah, um... Okay. So I think if we do... Three tiles this way. And extend this four tiles. That was a bad plan, why did we do that? <laughs> Why did I do that? Um, okay, let us um, sell all of this. And extend this. You will see the method to the madness shortly. So, our final train station of the day is going to be here. So that's going to give us a wee bit more money. Not that we were actually lacking some money in any way, shape or form. Um, but yeah, here we go. Um, so we're going to actually sell a little bit more of you expand you over by one and we're going to get a lift in here and so we're going to be very close to four starring this station as well Woo. so last time we played this game we managed a wonderful wonderful achievement of um of being able to actually hang on what, what is here are you platform four which is the blue one yes yeah, so we managed the achievement of uh, four starring three train stations uh, in one day. Because this isn't an, uh, a full overcrowd stream, we haven't actually. You know, we won't be at risk of doing anything similar, unfortunately. Uh, right, you're going to board the lift to get to the exit, and you're going to leave the lift to get to platform five. Uh, platform four. You are going to exit the lift to get to the exit, or platform four, and you're going to get in to get to platform Right, cool, we've got an actual factual working um, Right, let's sell you. We're gonna get gloomy points. But we will resolve that one momentarily. With one of those level three lights, and we'll grab another level three light over here. Cool. Okay. Um Grab some footbridges over. Oh, fuck. Now that one. Uh, as long as you avoid a rat plague, you're doing well enough. Yeah, I've I've, I've still got flashbacks to my nam plagues. To be honest, my nam. My, what? Where's the rat? No, I've still got I've still got flashbacks to my rat plague. To be honest, just that, it, and it never happened on camera, sadly. But just that sea of rats rushing into the pedestrianised areas, just. Ah, it'll never not live in my heart. Um, okay, right, so I actually need, so if somebody comes into this entrance here, uh, they're going to have to pass through the turnstile, so this is going to now be the turnstile for all platforms, which it now is. Um, so, oh, oh, somebody just got punched. Punched clean the fuck out. Oh, it's night time. So basically, every time there's a blue sign, I also need to make sure it is a pink sign as well. Um, fine, so that one's fine. Um, so this one is four and five. And it's five. Lift to five. Lift to five. And then that's us back on the main concourse, which is fine. Let's get rid of that. We don't need it anymore. Actually, I wonder now that this place is open. Um, let us. M Hello, bird. Can I help you? All right. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. So we can't. We can't sell this, can we? We have to. Sorry, we can't move it. We have to sell it. Which is fine. So if we slap this here, and then sell. No idea. Right, okay, let's make this a staff room. No, there used to be a way of selling individual bits. 
Hmm. Huff. Uh, right, okay, in that case. Sell, sell, sell your room gently down the cell. Oh, wait, why have I got an empty staff room here? No! No! Don't put stuff in it, let me sell this! Uh, <laughs> God, it's annoying. They should, they should 100% have an option to um, like pay extra to sell something that's full because I now can't do anything with this until morning and it's the most insufferable thing because my grand fucking plans have been usurped. Oh, actually, hang on. Uh, uh, I could have just done this, I suppose. Yeah, okay, that would have been a plan. Uh, right, okay, let us go ahead and reinstate all that shit which we have now done um, and speaking of reinstating shit uh, I need to get the signal automator for the last platform in so the signal automator is important for uh, being able to get your trains uh, to arrive without actually having to push a button each time right, let's sell this little light Um, so if we go to utilities, we can get that last substation up and running. We've now done. Uh, we can get some aircon, and then one more capacitor. Capacitors are very unlikely to be needed at this point in the game stage. Um, and we're actually gonna. Are we? What are we gonna do? Okay. Um, so. Let us go for what everybody wants to see in every train station that they ever go to. Pub. Yeah boy! Let's go. Uh, we've actually got space for something that's too wide. Um, or, hang on, hang on, hold the phone. No, 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 no. Um, let's sell you. Well, we can't sell you. Let's sell you. Um, you and you. Let's move you. Uh, let's go to the utility room. Let's sell you. Uh, let's replace you so that you can work out what you're trying to light up. Um, yeah, so we do need some bins over here, but we don't need an extreme number of bins. Uh, and the capacitors are pretty much useless. So this should now open us up for three, actually. So now if I go to commerce, um, I can get a pub and uh, let's go for a chicken shop yeah let's go perfect um, I don't think we need a staff room here I really don't uh, let's also sell this light here so that's gonna increase our gloomy flat factor ever so slightly uh, but we'll replace it just now and um, so this is actually going to resolve our shopping issue because I was going to have to try and like get rid of some of this space. But we're sorted. We're absolutely sorted. Banging. Um, okay. So now we just need to sort out this last platform then. And then we should be good to go. Um, we've got somebody who's a little bit lost, which I guess makes sense given the circumstances. Uh, so our Buckingham Palace guard is going to turn up... <laughs> Fucking sort some shit. Fine by me. And somebody's gonna make chunky surprise. Delicious. Um, okay, we could do with some CCTV cameras. Which is here. So CCTV cameras will help reveal if there is any criminal behavior on the go. Um, I'm just trying to think if there is, uh, okay, we've got, yeah. I'm just trying to work out where over here would be a good place to maybe introduce the wonderful world of, um, we've got lots of good shopping here, and there's just, the spacing is really difficult here. I guess this back wall could probably be, could probably accommodate one or two things 
It's just, it's, it's so awkward the way that this part of this, that I, because there's just so many little, so like I can't build through this wall because it's impassable terrain. Same here, same there, same there. There's just so much impassable terrain. Having said that, I still think we've done a really good job with this station. Um, so yeah, fuck it. Well, let's not worry too much about it. Let us 100% uh, it like the professionals that we are. Um, and then we can sort off and do something else. Um, um, okay, probably just want benches here. That's probably just going to be the simplistic thing. Uh, so if we slap in some toilets there, that will be fine. Cool. Okay. Um, so let's start this one. Um, right, so if... Your platform is coming in at 20 minutes past. Let's get you to come in at 40 minutes past. So these trains are now going to be stacked. Oh, hold the phone, hold the phone. None of you fuckers are using modern trains. Type three. Okay, right, hang on. You need to be type three. Can't 100% it if we're using fucking old trains. Um, you should also be type three. So the reason why type 3 is important is because it increases the capacity, the amount of capacity that uh, we increase by, uh, the more beans that I can shift in one fell swoop. And in the end, isn't that what's important? Uh, right, okay, so. Bin. Plant. Level 3 plant, and we'll go for a chode bin. Always paranoid about heating in these maps because uh, these train stations can be quite prone to overheating, so having good air conditioning throughout is pretty ideal. Sorted. We should probably slap a little tickle of commerce down in here just because we're kind of a wee bit short, I think. Um, so if we go ahead and get a kiosk. Kiosk is generally a good one um, because it covers all of the bases. Um, yeah, a kiosk, a bookshop at the end, and a burger stall. And we'll grab... Yeah, so uh, the kiosk is big, but it's a good all-rounder um, because you can buy drinks, you can buy sweets, you can buy like you know. Uh, it's got a phone box. What can y'all get in a kiosk? Right, hang on. Let's just do this one. So kiosk, 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 kiosk. Oh, taking me back to the top. Right, let's just try and find a kiosk. I just, oh, hang on, that was like a kiosk. Kiosk. So you can get magazines, so that's kind of covered in the bookshop. Crisps and sweets are covered in the vending machine. Soft drinks are covered, soft drinks and water are covered in the vending machine. Um, and so, yeah, so uh, it's four by four, whereas vending machines are two by two. But you get a little bit more from it, so it's kind of it's it's not it's not a bad one to have. To be fair, to be fair. Uh, right, so let's go ahead and um, finalize the bench design. Um, Bad plan, Chief. Bad plan, indeed. Um, okay. Yeah, okay. Um, so, what we need to do... Uh, ordinarily, I would just move these, but actually, I'm just going to sell them because it's easier. Um, actually, no, fuck it. Um, let's do this one and this one. Let's get 
some valuable entertainment down in here. So grab a bin there, bin there, bin there. Plant here, plant here. No, not a rat plague, damn it. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> well, I don't want to. Uh, I don't want a rat plague. Put it that way. Um, okay, let's grab a statue. Um, grab a pond. Grab a fuck off huge ornate cock because who doesn't love an ornate cock for absolutely no reason? Um, and now we've only got a little tickle of station that we still need to um, sort. Which is fine. Got all the commerce that we need over this side of the platform, so that is completely fine. We can just use this space for bench, go use bench. You know, this is actually hmm, this is actually kind of a rough spot here. With the stairs, uh, kind of not ideal. Come to think of it. Deal come to think of it at all. Uh, okay, so if we go for a bin, a bin, a plant, and a plant, that should be that part of the station nice and covered. So we could sit here and do commerce. Uh, but, uh, sorry, to do uh, our advertising, because you all know how much I like advertising. But actually, I think that we have, no we have now 100%ed this station. Uh, we could do the optional. We could do some of the optional objectives, actually. So, hang on, hang on. It's the easiest way to 100% a station. Um... Uh, so if we build a rat trap, great being able to do things and then just instantly sell. <laughs> uh, we can get level one alarm, um, which will uh, needs to be against a wall, and I think only the new station is the only place where I have access to a wall space. Uh, and then level, a level two hand sanitizer. So I think we have an entrance not being overutilized. Um, so I think it wouldn't be too out of place to have a wee cheeky bit of hand sanitizer floating around the place. There we go. So all of the optional objectives done. We're hard locked at 100% reputation and we have money up the wazoo. So let us uh, end this station. And yes, we're five stars. So to the max. Okay, so this is probably going to be one of the bigger challenges. This is this is going to be more to do with our management rather than our layout skills. Um, but we're going to have to try and get Parliament. So Parliament is the last one on this line. So this map's actually made up of two lines. It's made up of the south line, which connects the depot to Parliament. Um, and then there is also the north line, which connects Puddington Lane all the way around everything else, all the way to Waterbank Shelf. So before we get onto that... Let's see if we can't 100% Parliament, and let's go get some more drip while we're waiting. Aha, perfect, managed to catch that right in the load. So this is by far the biggest station, it is also the biggest station, um, <laughs> it's also the biggest station, um, with um, uh, an absolute hemorrhaging of frame rates, <laughs> which isn't great. So, um, yeah, I think, I think if memory serves me correctly, when we left this, we left this at a point where it was in the middle of absolutely hemorrhaging points for some reason, but I can't quite remember why. Okay, well, you know, we've got disgusting noises everywhere, which is great. War. What is good for? Absolutely not. Uh, right, okay, let's, um... So we've got a whole a whole bunch of disgusting stuff going, going on in various places. 
Um, so what we'll do is we'll put some hand sanitizer around the place. I think the more entrances that we can cover with a hand sanitizer, I think the happier a train station we're going to have. Because this place seems to be absolutely covered in disease, uh, which I think we're quite keen to try and clamp down on as much as we can. Um, okay, so... Um, so... Hand so we'll get hand sanitizer at all of the entrances uh, that will help us quite a bit. Uh, when we're in build mode, I will warn you here and now for free uh, that when we are in build mode, um, the frame rates will get very upset with me. Uh, and uh, yeah, with this being such a, a large and girthy train station, uh, not Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Why do we have such a... Why do we have such a litter crisis down here? Um, uh, okay, we really need to get through the work day here because we're kind of suffering from stuff. Litter is actually turning into quite a big issue. Uh, I wonder if we get more people on litter picking because it is currently, currently hemorrhaging. Uh, our frame rates, uh, not our frame rates, it's hemorrhaging our um, success rates at the moment. So at the moment we have people on roll specific things and they can do other things but um, yeah they're kind of, they're kind of not. I think what we need is night time to really start perking, perking up the place. I think what upsets me is there's lots of litter around the place but there is um, uh, right, actually, let's double check uniforms here. So let's go to uniforms. Um, so Davis, Davis and Ahmed, uh, and there's two Ahmed, so um, let's reduce them to numbers, which is the correct business way of doing everything. Um, so number one should be up in the main concourse here, and number seven Let's put you in this place here. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. So, uh, I was coming here with the hope of 100%ing uh, this challenge. <laughs> Hang on. What we need to do, we're gonna need to start upping the litter picking, I think. So, everybody who's two is gonna have to go on to one, everybody who's Three is going to go to two. One, one, okay, right, fine. Uh, yeah, right, that's fine. Because we're gonna, we're just going to have to really significantly up our game for, for litter picking this man. Uh, right, so the question is, can we hold on to the night time? Because I don't think I turned off um, hitting zero ends the game. So we need to get, we need to stay above zero before we get to midnight in order to be able to oh Jesus Christ. This is a really busy lift. Wait a minute. Why are these on a circular path? Oh, I think Are they looking for a lift? Hang on, I'm gonna stop telling them there's an exit down here. Oh no, hang on, no. Right, this is the third one. Right, we're gonna stop telling them there's an exit down here. Okay, fine. That should hopefully have fixed that little pathing crisis that we had going on. Okay, so we're almost... Hmm, we're almost there, right? So this bin is at crisis level. There are other bins, but... Okay. And so we're down to, yeah, okay, oh my god. Warning, your, sta your station reputation is getting very low. Uh, right, let's just improve, so your perception, so yeah, let's, so we've got a few level ups still to do. 
Um, you have. Oh, you ha you might be able to get quite a few. So if we can do, if we can do you for two strength, which we can, uh, that's going to be helpful because that unlocks her final uh, item slot, uh, as it does to Joan. So everyone should be able to carry four tools, which is good. So you can see if we look at our daily chart, high prices was a minor issue. Um, yeah, facility not pa facility not powered. Three people. We didn't run out of electricity at any point. Huffle. Um, three people were late. Two people were tired. Six people suffered from vomit-related issues. One from fumes. One from litter bugs. Uh, four percent of overcrowded. But by far our biggest loss of reputation was litter. Um, which is a colossal issue. Um. So we've got two bins here, that's not so bad. So I think one of the things that does actually help us a little bit is the inclusion of these staff staircases, uh, which allows a lot faster navigation through the map. So there's two bins, there's, yeah, there's basically some bins kind of tucked in around the place. Um, yeah, which is, which is quite good. Uh, so we're just gonna let this run throughout the night. So we don't, we don't have an issue with money. Money is absolutely fine. We just need to try and get this place up to uh, forty percent. Why have we got a? I've got one. Right. Okay. Let's get rid of you. Uh, and we can um, build a. What do we need? Uh, level two aircon. So one level two aircon will go here. Um, oh yeah. Jesus Christ. No. No. Go away. Um, we've got a trash compactor, that is fine. Uh, let's build another level 2 aircon, so that'll do that objective, which should help us a little bit, question mark. We'll slap in another bin in here. So power generation isn't an issue for us. Um, oh, actually, I say that, kind of is. Um, case we need to have a wee think about where we could do another thing. Right, hang on. Why, why is this still ticking down? How is litter still an issue? They had all night to unlitter the place. Come on. Um, I'm just trying to think where I could possibly squeeze in some more electricity stuff. Oh hey, it's finally going back up! 24%! Would you look at that? 25%? I mean, it's still morning time, so you know there's that, but yeah. Level. 
Let's just see if a level one generator will do this. Uh, two fuel barrel. Right, th is that enough? It's not enough, but the power drain drops off at night time. So, you know, <laughs> take from that what we will. Um, mm -hmm, okay. A thief has entered your train station. Oh no, not a thief. Uh, okay, right, now that we've reprioritized everyone to eliminate litter, uh, we need to see re reputation today. So reputation today, litter is still the biggest thing. So we've currently had just under 2,000 people in the door, and 20% of them report litter, which is a nature of curiosity. So when, okay, we're still on, we're still on 50%. Uh, we're still on four stars. So once we get to, you know, if, if we can get all the way to five stars, then we've done it. And this one, ooh, hello, Jones, Jones, you chief. Uh, right, let's go ahead and give you some speed. So yeah, once we can, oh, hang on, how are you lost? There's a map, you're standing right next to a map. How are you possibly lost? There you go, Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, so like I said, We've used as much space as we can. Our commerce is good. Our layout is good. We've got luxury as much as we can. Um, success or not success in this map is all about the management and trying to balance the scenarios. Um, so at the moment we're scenario list, which isn't so bad. Uh, our power reserves are keeping good. We've got thief noises, which is not good. Oh, somebody's screaming. It's a bad sign. Trains, trains, everywhere you look. Everywhere you look. So, I guess the thing is, so we are, uh, depending on how the match day goes tomorrow, we are at risk of 100%ing this one in the next couple of minutes. So, the question for you guys who are still in the chat is, would you like to start from the eastern train station or the western train station when we get to the north line. They're both the same level, but east or west. You know that, we're just gonna eeny meeny many more. it. Uh, Ackman's gone and got pointed up and he is now maximum level attuned, which is amazing. Right. Perfect. So we're up to 77%. Does that mean that how we're looking if we do this? Still on four stars. Okay, so we need we do need to get we do need to get to 100 percent So it's not gonna happen today. It will happen tomorrow though. Oh no! IQK Knuckles 15 has been given a muty boy for spamming links. Big sad. And it's night time, okay, right, we're up at 86%, um, can we... God damn it, right, okay, fine. So we'll keep it on fast forward, everyone's gonna go, so we're still going to, um, you know, repair everything that needs to be repaired. Uh, litter is still the biggest issue, but it's down at 16% now, it was 20% when the day started. Um, so we're just going to get what can be fi fixed. Um, so we're now far enough into the game that uh, all of our staff have um, different roles, which is good. Um, it does take a little bit to get the balancing right, uh, but generally speaking, um, it is better to have people doing specific roles. Um, it's good to have people doing all the roles, but at low priority. Um, but like people specialist in the right roles uh, in order to make sure that um, actually people have 
different people have different things as number one priority. Because if, for example, you have a passenger who's lost and everybody has their um, their like public help down at priority three, which is what I did have, uh, then what it means is that they don't... Um, it, it can take a while for them to get help, which is not a good sign. So we're now into 94%. We're still, we're still not there. So what's, what's our issue? So tracks built, five doors. Okay. Right, so optional goals is an issue for us. So let's look. So we've got to build two level one alarms. Um, so we need we need some free wall space somewhere, and I'm unsure about where we're gonna actually find it. But I, I think if we can get, hmm. problem is is uh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Get Lost, how's it going? Right, we don't need, we, we've got seventy seven thousand dollars in the bank, um, so we don't need as much ruthless capitalism uh, and so yeah that's done at our optional alarm um, and so once we tick up to 100% which finger cross should be soon should be soon oh it's just ticked down right okay let's let's very quickly see if that's done the trick five stars to the map we've done it Woo! I never have to look at that train station again Oh, thank fuck. Mr. Get Laws, east or west? Pick a direction. East or west. Um, yeah, I'm doing not so bad. I'm tired and I'm kind of stressed because I wanted to do a flight sim stream today. And did that go to plan? No, it did not fucking go to plan. This computer crashed once and twice. And so now we're doing some overcard instead. Uh, and we're going to go for the west station. So we've done the south line. The south line is now done to completion. All five stations are sorted. We're now going to move on to the north line, which is a bigger line, and the call is west. So we're going to start at Waterbank Shelf, and let's go. Let's go. So this new train line, we're going to have the benefit um, of... Um, oh, actually, I quite, I quite like that design, actually. That was, that was quite a nice design. Ooh. Okay. Well, this is a bit... Heh. <laughs> Uh, problematic. Uh, okay. Right. Fine. Hmm. Okay. So, immediately in my head, I'm thinking um, that this or this area is going to be the secure area. Uh, this area is going to be the entrance area, and we're going to start off here with um, This is going to be kind of messy actually, but fuck it uh, Right So sell you Get some Hama dollar bill back Start you. How much money does this leave us with? Five thousand. Hmm, not a lot. Um, okay, so platform. Slap a platform in here. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, <clears throat> Okay, level two turnstiles, let's get these on the go. So this, uh, uh, yeah, this station isn't going to be busy enough that I think we're going to overly have to worry about um, turnstile use. Um, I think, I hope, we'll see how that pans out. Uh, right, let's, uh, so hang on, so uh, have, what's our gap between this? So it's seven, that's kind of an awkward number. Um, so if we remove two, that's five. Five is probably going to be fine. Um, so we're going to do...
So this is cost neutral doing this, which is fine. Um, I think we'll probably just sell off this, to be fair. Um, so that's going to give us two little passageways. <coughs> uh, mm -hmm. Okay, I think I'm going to have to put some temporary stuff in here that will eventually be moved once we start. Uh, generating some whole dollar bill. Um, but we need we need to get the basic station up and off the ground. Um, so we're going to grab... Um, we're actually going to grab two entrances. It is the more expensive option for early game. Um, but I think we need to do it. Um, so what we need is some ticketing machines. So one of these here, one of these here. That's all fine and good. Um, you are going to be platform one and eventually platform two. You're going to be exit and you're going to be exit. Perfect. Um, so yeah, I might have a chance to do more turnstiles over here. So this is going to be the um, shopping area outside of the ticketed zones. Um, and there's going to be another shopping area in here. Um, Utility is probably going to be over here and over here, but temporarily I'm going to have to put it in here. Um, so first things first, let's grab one light here, one light here, one light here, and yeah, okay, gonna need no oh, fuck money. Um, hey. Uh, right, let's do level two light in here and here. That, that, that can get started later. That's absolutely fine. Um, okay, so let us now go to a utility room. And if we make this... Let's say that one. Um, okay. So, let us slap in a substation. And we're out of money. Perfect. <laughs> um, okay, so straight away we're going to open this. And open this. Our electricity use is okay. Uh, that is giving us a little bit more hollow dollar bill, which is quite good. Uh, so, we'll go ahead and get a capacitor in here. Um, and... A, um, trash compactor? Trash compactor? I know you're here somewhere. Garbage compactor. Uh, and we'll grab a big wheel of in. Okay. Right, fine. So that'll keep us going for the moment. Let's get a train on the go. No maps. Maps are going to be a little bit of an issue, to be fair. Uh, okay. Yeah, fine. Um, so yeah, that'll keep us going for just now. Actually, hmm, yeah, we could put a little control room. Because we're only going to need the one control room, aren't we? So if we put a wee tickle of control room in here. And that means when we have the hollow dollar bill to do so. Oh my god, right, we need ticket, we need ticket machines. Right, hang on, hold it for. We need so many ticket machines. Oh, I can't afford it! I can't afford more ticket machines! Oh god! Okay, so we've got overcrowding issues, uh, which is fair enough. So I think in that case, we should start getting some beans on shift. Uh, let's get them all on shift because, uh, because of reasons. Uh, right, so we need some toolkits. So let's first start. We're just going to get some megaphones. And we can't afford them. So this is going to be really rough for us at first uh, until we can start getting people sorted. Um... But don't worry, we will get there. Once I can get my glorious capitalism up and running, um, everything will be Gucci. See, look at that. These guys are barely arriving here and their train's already here. Let's go. 
so you're looking for a mop. Let's see if I can oblige. So we'll grab one mop. Probably grab a litter picker. Uh, you're looking for a tablet. Um, okay. So we'll just try and deal with what comes up as and when it comes up. Um, so yeah, litter is going to be our biggest issue. Oh, station reputation getting very low already. I wonder. I wonder if. I wonder if actually opening up the second one. Yeah, okay, okay. So we're going to fail this one. Uh, we've, we've, yeah, okay, fine, fine, fine. We've learned our lesson. We know what we've done wrong. Okay. So we, we, we yeah, we do, we've just got a wee bit over ambitious. Um, and there's now too many people uh, and not enough space to shift them. Um, so any second now we'll get the fail. Any second that. Oh, hey, wait, what? Minus one? What? All right, hang on, hold this one. Um, exit with no save, yes. So we'll, tr we'll, tr we'll try that again. Uh, oh, fuck, we're all the way back here. Right, hang on, hold this one, hold this one. Okay. Yeah, I think I actually maybe did turn off reputation mode. So yeah, two entrances to start us off with is maybe a wee bit too much. Oh fuck, all the way back here, right? Okay, hang on, hang on, hold the phone, pause. Uh, click to close. Click to open. Yeah, so it's taken an auto save. Um, yeah, so we're gonna sell this for now. Uh, it's taken an auto save basically when this started. Uh, fuck. Thankfully, this is cost neutral. Okay, I don't know why that's there. Uh, right, okay, let's sell you, 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 you. Okay, fine. Um, yeah. So, one, two, three, we'll keep that one, and then we'll start selling all of this. Start selling. Let's move you up into here. Um, and we'll keep a three gap here. Sell you. Oh, goody rats! Perfect. Could you move? Oh, okay, you're just going to disappear. All right, fine. I guess that could be a little bit. Fine. Uh, right, let's get our staff all on duty. Let's get you guys on the go. Right, tools. Um, okay, so we need a right. uh, a litter picker. Mop. Megaphone an assistant tablet. Okay. Um, right, let's go to utilities. Um, grab one of these, one of these. Okay, that should keep us going for just now. Right, so we're gonna need to get some bins in places. So we'll grab a bin and a plant here. How far does a level three bin take us? I'm actually, <laughs> a level three bin uh, does take us quite far, which is pretty good. Uh, don't have enough money for the plant. Okay, so. Oh yeah, no staff room. That is that is a smidgen of an issue. Oh hey, everyone's on strike because I can't afford to pay them. Woo! Amazing. Okay, we've got bins though, so that should hopefully, hopefully prevent those those issues. Fingers crossed. Two hundred and forty dollar. 
so this I think having only the one entrance is much more manageable, which is good. We've got enough staff on duty um, for people to be able to get stuff sorted, which is fine. Um, yeah, what we really, what we really do need. Um, we're gonna suffer a bit from gloominess, I think. We'll cross that bridge later. Um, yeah. Um, I think what we want, uh, let's go ahead and grab a cheeky little bit of commerce. So the commerce is going to help us start getting a lot of um, money together. So we're going to put this, designate this as a staff room just now. Oh, 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 he's a crying. He's a crying. He's having a bad old time. Um, right, okay, let's get staff so far. Um, and then what we need is a water cooler. A staff vending machine, which we no longer have enough money for. Oh, we can't afford to pay our staff, great. They're all unhappy and, uh, yeah. Oh, fuck. So we forgot to call in this train. This was, this was a wee bit of an issue. But we're, man we're managing to maintain reputation quite well, which is, which is pretty good. Uh, I think what we want, what we really, really want, um, is to start getting a whole load more commerce in because we don't have much in the way of money for the rest of the night yeah I know we can't afford to pay people um yeah it, so basically the for just now the more commerce that we can bring in the better everything is going to be so yeah. Uh, everybody's on strike. We're not going to make any more money today, so we're just going to skip straight through to dawn. And now the people are going to start coming on in. We do need a watering bucket when I do eventually have money. Because otherwise our plants are going to expire. Uh, a watering can is 100 doer. All the green, <laughs> look at the green bars as they, as the beans start doing stuff. Great, so we've got money, uh, we've got a little bit of money back on the cards. Uh, let's start getting that one. Let's get, uh, I can hear people with disease, so let's go for first aid, which I don't have enough money for. It's 125. To oh my god, they've all got the flu. <laughs> Um, okay, that's gonna be a problem. Uh, right, can we please? Oh, hey, station has been awarded play on. So apparently, apparently, yeah. Oh fuck! Oh my god, look at all this. Oh my, oh my god, look at all the disease. This is just uncomfortable. Come on, I need money. I need the money to be able to do this. Okay, right, first aid, Jesus Christ, right. <laughs> oh, I can just hear an endless stream of fucking sneezing, it's awful. Okay. Train. Okay, good, we're first aiding, we're first aiding people up to the zoo, great. Starting to get some trash taken. Uh, right, we need, now that we have some dealer, we need a vending machine once we can afford it. Once we can get a vending machine. Um, 200 dealer. 
right, uh, staff vending machine, because that's going to deal with their hunger ever so slightly. Um, so that's fine. Right. So there we go. Now they can start resolving that particular problem. Happy days all run. Perfect. Oh, Jesus. We're going to designate this one as our control room. Let's go do some of that. Right. Let's go ahead and start getting a little bit of commerce in. Um, oh, hang on, hang on. We don't have a signal on here. Uh, right, verdict all after. Um, yeah, so we're just going to line absolutely everything that there is to be lined um, with adverts. Particularly this this wall here, we need we need to sort this wall out because this wall is probably going to be our, our, our biggest thing. So, <sighs> capitalism, capitalism will be my savior. Uh, I actually need a toolkit on the urgent. Is that all the same to you, sir? Uh, we're getting near the end of the workday here. So overall, what's our issues? Bad shopping range, litter, no toilet. Okay. Resolve the toilet issues with a little bit more money, I'm thinking. Right, um, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go thresholds. Okay, so we need to start being a little bit smarter about our stuff. I think we need to start, I think we need to move a lot of this advertising over to the other side um, because it's going to be the only way, uh, yeah. I think it's going to be the only uh, dependable way for us to make a metric feck ton of money. Uh, and it's the end of the workday. Uh, well, it's not the end of the work day, it's the end of the day that we can afford to pay people. Um, so... <laughs> that sounded delicious. Let's go. Yeah, I'm, so, I'm really not used to working with the manual fucking trains. Okay, we've got enough people starting to get back. Great. Why are people just chilling around here? This is, this is... Okay, get here or get in my train station. Oh my god, all of these you could not afford to pay anyone fucking things. Oh, 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 we got drunk. Hang on, hang on. In that case, we're going to need to go to tools. Um, tools. And we're going to need a crime tablet. And possibly a taser and all. Um, right, I wonder if we can get a signal automator, because getting a signal automator now, yeah, okay, so I can get one. Uh, getting a signal automator now um, basically allows me to not have to worry about, oh my god, that was so fucking expensive. I did not think for the splittest of seconds it was going to be that goddamn expensive. Okay, so basically uh, that getting the signal automator means I can start um, ignoring um this train platform <laughs> um and start really worrying about um the the people a wee bit more the good news so moving this ad so basically um the, the game ha is quite reluctant to give you advertising bonuses when people uh, spawn in. Don't get me wrong, having them on the back wall is still a great way to um, get 
uh, get advertising views, um, but it's not maybe the most effective early on. Whereas this this thoroughfare here is really good for um, getting all that stuff started. Could you fuckers stop being sick in that train station? Just for two fucking seconds, please. Uh, right, okay, everybody is back and working, which is great. Um, we're getting a lot of complaints for seats, which is actually pretty valid. Uh, so I think we're going to go ahead. No, oh, we can't afford it. can't afford luxury benches. Yeah, I think for just now, probably not a bad idea to grab in some uncomfy benches. Uh, or it would be if I had any semblance of money. But I don't, so here we are. Uh, right, getting towards the end of the workday. Uh, we're going to call this train in a little bit early because the more people that we can get shifted, the better it is going to be. Uh, and I'm wondering, for the sake of um, travel bonuses, once this train goes, and it will go soon, so as soon as it leaves, we're going to take a pause. Oh, well, okay, I can't. Okay. Uh, okay. So, what one? Uh, how many carrots? So yeah, four is the max. So if we can extend this by one, which is 220, which we just don't have enough money for. Um, okay, I'm starting to think, yeah, we're probably... Right, let's put... Uh, okay, where's our Buckingham Palace guy? You uh, can go off shift. Uh, Probably only need one of each kind of person in. Um, you, you look like you have the same uniform. Right, okay, so that hopefully cut down the number of people that we have in. So we're just going to skip straight through to Marnin. Ah, let's do this. I'm aware that we can't afford to pay people. Oh, look, we've got an angry person. They're here and they're angry. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck. A lot of fisting going on. Uh, yeah, let's look at uniforms of the people that are in. Oh, well, I can't because we don't have the, the thing. Um... Um, right, okay, fine. Um, yeah, it's gonna come on in here. Right, I think what we want is. Oh, well, I can't afford that one because it's expensive as fuck. Okay. Now, nah, we, we, we need to go back to our old tricks, right? We need to, we need to get advertising because. We've got money and we could spend it on useful stuff and that would make people happy, but it's then gonna take us so fucking long in order to be able to do like the most basics of stuff. So we just, we really need to keep cracking on with um, our copious amounts of advertising. And then, and only then when that is done, can we start wonderful goal of actually making this a good station to live and work in. So I think we're kind of going to get at a point where uh, uh, income today... Okay. Well. Uh, right, where did we get to? We got as far as... No, I can't remember. Let's just go back to the basics. So eventually this, this place will stop being a complete capitalist hellhole. But today is not that day. 
Not that day at all, my good sirs. Warning, station reputation is getting very low. Well, as we discovered, we have the reputation thing turned off, so, um, you know, that's all fine and good. That's all fine and good. What, is, what is that curiosity number? So bad shopping, oh no, no, no rep reputation today. So no toilet is currently the biggest issue, which I guess, I guess I can actually sympathize with that one. Um, and it is something that we can do, we could do with fixing. Um, so, grab a toilet, slap one toilet in here. What's that done for our power usage? No, nah, our power usage is fine, to be honest. Power usage is perfectly fine. So that toilet, uh, that's gonna help. Um, okay. Uh, this dude's missing a bench. Uh, yeah, so there's no more entrances up here. Yeah. Uh, right, let's grab another toilet and Uh, right, it is now after dark, so let's turn you, let's, actually fuck it, let's sort you. Yes, I do want to extend the track, boy. Perfect, right, okay, so this five car train is now going to give us a little bit more wiggle room. Uh, and there's now not much else that we can do overnight, so we're just going to skip straight through to Marnin. Um, and we're going to, okay. I think probably going to start being okay soon. I think, I think, I think. Um, right, so let's grab a toilet on the um, this side. As soon as we have the funds to do so. Oh, it's actually nice. Perfect. Um, okay, great. So we'll need to, our next thing will be to start getting some ticket machines. So uh, like, once you have done the first... Um, once you've done the first, um, uh, the top levels on the uh, other, uh, in other areas, it this just becomes quite hard to do. thinking actually yeah I'm just wondering does there exist a way to get to a lower floor without magic <laughs> So basically, what, what, what I'm getting at, um, as far as I'm aware, the only way of um, of getting to a lower floor is by having a spawn point, so this is a spawn point, this is a spawn point, and you get the spawn points for the doors uh, on the floor that you are trying to get to. Uh, I don't know if it is possible. I wonder if, I wonder if it's done by do so if we do ground floor. Yeah, so I don't, I, I don't think I can. I think it's quite limited, actually. So, mm. Mm. there kind of goes that one. Right. Okay, we're actually ticking up um, on reputation, which isn't too shabby. I wonder if at least early game we just keep this place as a just massive 
advertising corridor because it is basically going to give us the money to absolutely motherfucking blitz this map. You don't have enough money for this. What? We'll do soon, I'll tell you that for free. It's great because you look away for a couple of seconds and then you come back and you just like, you're just constantly just making an unreasonable amount of money. Capitalism, baby! Let's go! Perfect. Okay, great. Um, so yeah, so we're kind of almost done with our little advertising hellscape. We're going to wait and manually guide this train in because we want... Oh, actually, it's more or less going to come in on the hour, isn't it? Um, yeah, just the quicker that we can get the train in towards the end of the workday, uh, the better, the better it's all going to be. Perfect. So now it's night time. There isn't really that much stuff needs done. How are we doing for electricity use? Not great but not bad. So no bad shopping range is our worst thing. Um, that won't stop us from being successful uh, just now. So that is kind of not a bad sign. So let's just gonna, we're gonna skip right through until morning. Um, and then we're gonna go ahead uh, and Somebody has the flu, oh no. Honestly, like I, I, I like I wish there was some way of like tracking just how much of this game has been me clicking on adverts <laughs> clicking on adverts and putting down advertising. Because I'm pretty sure the like answer is a very, very unreasonable number. Burger stall advert. Chicken shop, pub, pharmacy. So yeah, we're still on twenty percent. So we'll move all of this. This will eventually be taken up with like ch uh, chairs and important things. Ooh, no money. Oh, money. Oh, is anyone going to inspect there? Nah, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, literally all breathable space in this train station has been taken up. Uh, with adverts. So that will now uh, really start allow us to start accelerating our efforts. Um, which is pretty good. Uh, right, let's get another ticket machine. Here. Uh, level 2 ticket machine. So if I'm right, that should now tick us over the electricity use. And I am in fact right. Okay, so we're gonna get a second substation. What do you mean we don't have enough money? Huffle. Mm. Yeah, I'm actually starting to wonder if I kind of want to change my mind about having this, like... Uh, so, I, w I was going to delete all of this and move it um, elsewhere in the station. But, like, having it as this kind of wonderful hellscape... <laughs> um, ...is quite useful. <laughs> uh, right, okay, so can I get that? Um, yeah, because you basically got this narrow space for generating a metric fuck ton of money. Uh, so the reason, the, the thing that I'm thinking, so the maximum train length that you can get in this game is six carriages. <sighs> I'm 
So I'm wondering. I'm wondering if I actually shrink this side to about here and this side to here. And then that gives me a kind of weird gap in the middle for using his utility space. Uh, allows me to open up this side a little bit more than it currently is, which would be quite helpful. Um, and then the side all the way down here can be for commerce. So basically, uh, this game is quite smart in that uh, you can see this tunnel is here, but this doesn't mean that the train tracks aren't still going through this side. So if I, uh, if I go ahead, you can see that there's an area that I cannot build on because just because you can't see them doesn't mean the train tracks aren't still there, which is pretty smart, actually. Um, so, um, so we actually now have a lot of hollow dollar bill. Let's let's just go ahead and see about that, shall we? So let's uh, try and get rid of all of this. Uh, okay. Uh, I. What's it find over here? Uh, okay, so we're going to. What? I'm not trying to call trains. Oh, I wonder if I need to sell all this shit. Uh, right, let's try it now. Um, so, yeah, okay, that was the problem. Right, so if we sell this... What? Oh, fuck, that's just refunded all my feckin' adverts banging. Uh, right, okay, let's try and get this to sit. not too bad. Uh, let's maybe go one more than needs be. Extend the track. Oh, well, fuck. Money. There goes all the money that we made. Um, mm -hmm. okay. In that case... Oh, it's fine, yeah, we, I, I forgot the way. So, uh, the longer the platform, the more electricity you use, which makes sense. Uh, I had kind of neglected, um, yeah, <laughs> okay, that's fine. So basically this now gives us a little bit more flexibility to use a wee bit more space in this side for this platform, um, so that's, that's something that will come up in a bit. Uh, we'll need to redo our advertising hellscape. So yeah, we'll make this into one of the passageways down into um, into the kind of retail place, uh, and that this will leave this one as utility space. So I think that's kind of fine to be fair. Um, okay, cool. So method to the, there's a method to this madness here. Don't worry about it. Um, okay, so this is going to be that one. Seven hundred and twenty dollars is what we're going to need. Cool. Um, right, so we've got Brute, but he's not actually been seen doing anything yet. So technically speaking, we can't arrest him. Um, I know we're going to take a reputation penalty for this one, but that's fine in my book. Oh well, he's just been seen. Well, yeah, actually, sorry, he's not been seen knocking somebody clean out, but he has done it nevertheless. Now he's been seen, and now he can get nicked. Uh, okay, right, so, um, uh, we're gonna make this one staff only. Staff only zone, good, perfect, okay. Um, so basically, we're gonna have an extended utility space, uh, down here. Uh, whether or not we keep this one will be up for debate. Um, Oh my god, yeah. Hee <laughs> hee. 
Uh, right, okay, we'll pop that in there. Uh, I don't know if this doesn't seem to be like a very hot train station or something, but like, there doesn't seem to be an awful lot of, uh, oh. A group of hoodlums have been assaulting locals and staff. Higher security. Uh, well, what I'm hearing, because we have security, uh, what I'm hearing is, uh, let's get a taser. Um, let's also grab a defib. Um, let's grab another litter picker. I'm trying to think of what else we could probably want to try and get a... Yeah, okay, right. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and, uh, install some CCTV cameras. Must be built in the station concourse. We'll grab one here, one here, um, one can come above this entrance, and then we'll have, oh fuck, just got knocked out, uh, we'll have one there, how are we doing for power, power we're doing okay for, great, okay, uh, oh, brutes, oh my god, so many brutes, oh god, this is rough, somebody get the taser, think of the tasers, um, Uh, right, so, yeah, the only thing we're really suffering with at the moment is a bad shopping range, which I can respect. Um, yeah, okay, uh, fine. So, we'll open this here. No, that sell you. Yeah, so you will be here. Sell you. Uh, right, so open you as a utility room. Fine. Um, terrific! Um, okay, let's just get through to morning because nobody seems to be doing anything. Great. Um, and yeah, the flow of passengers will get our advertising juices flowing. Um, yeah, so here we go. How much? I, for, I keep forgetting to check, actually. Uh, summary, income, today's income. Well, sales are still the biggest thing, which is kind of surprising. But hey -o. Uh But advertising is almost doubling it, which is pretty, which is pretty good. Um, yeah. Uh, so what we're going to do... What we're going to do... Let me come for you. Uh, so we're going to grab some bins. This is where we're going to be. This is where we're going to have the trash compactor. So trash compactor is useful. I think that tipples us all. No, we're not. We're fine. We're fine. We've got plenty of space. Plenty of space, indeed. Um. Okay. I think we can probably grab a level three capacitor here. Uh, we'll grab a level two aircon here for when we can afford it. Actually, no, level, yeah, so that should go there. Oh, right. Uh, right, okay, let's get 800 dueler. So, so I think, yeah, so I think we've done that one perfectly, fine. Uh, okay, great. Oh my god! Okay, we are earning almost double in advertising what we are in trade ticket sales. Capitalism, baby! Let's go! <laughs> ah, that's amazing! Uh, right, okay, let's slap one of these in here. Uh, and then a level 2 air conditioner uh, will be necessary. Um... What is our optional objective? So, 75% reputation is the first. Uh, yeah, okay, right, so, right, so there's not many objectives in this one, which is, which is fine by me. Level 2 aircon. 
Okay, yeah. So chairs and shopping is kind of largely what we're missing here. Um, fine, I think we can live with that one. Um, right, I can't put anything there because of raisins. Okay. So let's try and maximize our advertising um, ahead of the next day starting. Oh, that's actual newspaper stand. <laughs> actually, come to think of it, we can probably have a small... We can actually probably move this staff room in here as well. That's actually not a bad shout, dear Eris. Not a bad shout at all, um, because... Basically, the more, so like, you know, staff don't lose much by having to travel mildly further to get to their restroom, uh, but opening up more space for uh, public areas can in fact be a nice and big deal for us. Um, so I wonder if we just go ahead and do that. Can't afford the footbridge here, I don't think. Whoa! Where the fuck do you come from? Go away. Go away. I don't, I don't want you. Pause. I didn't, I didn't ask you for your update, son! Yes, I would like to update. Go away. Right, okay, fine. Sorry. Uh, right, yeah. Uh, okay, well, we definitely don't have enough money now. But let's just skip the dawn. And we will start in getting... Can't afford the footbridge, that won't last long, because look at all the advertising. Oh, yes. Absolutely glorious. Ah! Money, money, money. Must be money in a money world. Oh, well, that perk has been knocked out. Okay, uh, this will then allow me, because it's going to be quite a big, big staff room. Oh, your eyebrows don't have enough money. How much do we need? 420. <laughs> 420, boy! Ah, amazing. So we're still, we're not, we're not, like, losing. We're not really winning either. Um, with the stuff that we've got. Um, okay, so let's move this. Huh? Why can't I move it? Come down a break. Uh, right, okay, so let's get some of this stuff over here. Let's get some of this stuff over here. Uh, I wonder, can we sell this entire room? The room must be empty. Uh, let's just sell all of this for extra doer for the moment. Um. So if we go to staff amenities, uh, and we'll go for sofa, sofa, um, we could do with the first aid kit um, for the staff to not get their arse handed to them. Uh, a tea station. Um, probably grab... Probably grab an arcade boy. So this is a well-equipped um, staff room. I'm thinking. So I wonder if we move this up to here. Why can't you sell a sofa once you put it down? Uh, but basically, yeah, so if we put this sofa in here, uh, if we go to the staff utility room, sell this space, and then if we just sell this, oh, I'm fucking starting to again. Uh, right, okay, so yeah, so we've just sell sold a little bit of unnecessary unnecessariness, uh, and that should hopefully keep this sorted. Great! Um, okay, so, um, we're gonna make about as much money as we ever are. Okay, 
I think we sell this. You and you, uh, and we move these two substations over here. So if we whack these ones down, uh, that should keep us. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Uh, so once this bin is okay, so it's not quite sellable yet. But it will be soon. So now realistically all we have to worry about is uh, a tool room. Um, and that is kind of, that is kind of yeah, great. Um, cool, okay. Um, so, plan of action is we're going to have another corridor. I'm actually wondering if we have this as the entrance and this as the exit only. So four in, four out. And the reason that I would suggest such a thing is because with the commerce here, everybody who's exiting the train station has to go past commerce and so they're kind of likely to buy something, is my logic. Uh, right, okay, is there anything that needs done? Not really. Uh, right, okay. Uh, let's use some of our extra door uh, to get some luxury benches. And in fact, uh, we're going to now start the process of getting ready to open up this station again, or the part of the station again. Um, so we're going to sell this one and we're going to expand this in as much as we can. Uh -huh. um. Where's the entrance? Why can't I see the entrance? Oh, entrance. It's right there. Uh, right, so entrance is going to be here, uh, but we're not really going to do very much with it at the moment. Uh, we're gonna wait until daytime. There we go. Perfect. Right. So you're done. So we can sell you, and we can sell all of you. Perfect. That gets us a little bit of money back. So let's use that money to go ahead and grab a level three light over this end of the platform. Um, and I think we can now start. Focusing on some good things. Somebody's using the staff arcade machine. Uh, right, let's get a busker on the go. And I think if we grab a wee cheeky statue. Perfect. Um, okay, so we've now got some space to fill up with adverts. So, daily grind, crisps, uh, drinks. We're going to save this space for maps because we're kind of a wee bit sore on the map front at the moment. Uh, right, phone box adverts. So here we go. Yeah, uh, we do just need to bear in mind that navigation is going to be quite important. Quite important indeed. Uh, as is the fact that we've actually. <laughs> we've got fuck all tools. Okay. I'm wondering if we. So we, we're going to have a lot of space here for retail, and that's going to be fine. So I'm wondering if we utilize. Um, trying to see if there was a way. No, actually, no. That is is the answer to that. Um. Okay. Okay. How do we do this? How do we do this? So basically, this this tool room here is going to have its entire existence moved to here. So 
this is going to be the footbridge to here. Uh, then you're going to be this one, and then you all the way back here. Perfect. Right. Okay. Right. So this is going to be the new tool room for when the time comes. The staff, they can work in the gloom. That's not a problem. Got a lot of brutes entering the train stations. Oh dear. A number of. Oh god. It's. Oh god. It's all turning violent. Got one person with the taser. Come on, taser your little socks off. Yes, look at that. Taze him, taze him, get him. <laughs> My god, how many brutes are there? Because it sounds like there's a metric fuck ton. But, well, we've dealt with them mostly. Mostly. Bye, Relic. Catch you later. Uh, right, if we put this tool room here. Oh, goody. Right, okay, seriously. G -g come on. Can we just keep paging all of these people? Jesus Christ. And yet somehow through that entire shit show, uh, our reputation kept on going up. Uh, right, okay. We're going to very quickly put everybody off duty for just now. Um, so, off shift, off shift, off shift, off shift, off shift, and off shift. So, the reason that we're doing that is because that returns all of the goods to here. Uh, which means, oh well, fuck, I can't actually. Right, yeah, uh, it returns them here, which allows me to move them. Uh, and moving them is going to be important because um, I'm going to need to, s I'm going to sell that space. So it's going to be a wee bit disjointed, but that is fine. So it's going to be a wee bit more, um, That's what I'm looking for. It's going to be a wee bit uh, harder for them to get to at the moment. Um, but, I mean, this is a space I really want to utilize for better things that I kind of currently can't. Um, so, yeah. Oh, look at this. Look at the size of it. I mean, this till room. I'm going to have tools for days. I wish I'd done this with a little bit more planning. <laughs> right, hang on. So let's just do litter pickers. Let's, uh, yeah, I kind of want to try and group things as much as I can. Uh, so we'll do litter pickers here. Um, I've already got watering cans. Oh no, I picked up an advert. Did not want. Uh, okay, um, right. So watering can here, watering can here. Um, Grab, oh fuck, that's kind of awkward. Um, right. Crime desk here. We'll move Dazer here. Mm -hmm. uh, right, so first aid defibrillator. That is fine for just now. So this now frees up space to sell this, uh, which now frees up space to sell all of this. Um, so we'll use our remaining money to uh, get as many of the adverts as we can restored. Eventually, and by eventually, and not actually all that long, uh, we're gonna get, um, most of this back. I sold away. But just until we do, as always, we need the money. Okay, fine. Uh, why can't we sell this one little square? Okay, fine. Um, yeah, okay, fine. Uh, so this will now allow us to get all of the staff back on shift. On shift, right, okay, perfect. 
So they can all go do stuff. There isn't really a great deal of stuff that needs done that I really care about. So we're now just going to skip it on. Here we go. Perfect. <sighs> okay. Very well. So it's rush hour. Yeah, here we go. You can see that we're... Um, we are gaining advertising like nobody's business. Uh, great, terrific. So let's go ahead and get a indicator board um, and a level three map. Um, so that is going to be quite helpful here. Uh, right, let's go ahead and start this plan to get shit over here. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so, um, reason that we're doing this is we're going to get some turnstiles. Uh, perfect. Okay, so this area is now secured off, which is great. Um, so so, if we bring this in here, so this now defines, so this is the definition of our little shopping mall that's going to be over here. We're going to have copious amounts of seatings uh, and maps and utilities. Starting to get a little bit dark, put my lights on. Uh, okay, so uh, we need a level 3 light. Go in here to light up this entire place. So we've now done that one. Uh, so if we call this one exit. 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 And exit. There we go. Perfect. Um, so that means our two exit ones here can be to platform 1 and to platform 1. Perfect. Great. Um, so all that's left to do... There's not really much use for this uh, interior wall here, um, except for glorious, glorious capitalism, um, which is, you know, the only thing that we love in this game. Hot dog, baby, hot dog. We're doing for money, we're still doing okay for money. Uh, yeah. I think my favorite thing about adverts is you actually still get you you get full cost for that for selling them. Uh, so you can literally just like any wall that you're only using temporarily, fill it with advertising. Uh, and you know when it's time for that advert to go bye-bye, um, you'll get all of the, the money back for it, which is which is great. Absolutely amazing. So in a situation like this, uh, you know, yeah. Capitalism, baby. So anybody getting off any trains has to walk past every advert under the sun. Actually, out of curiosity, how much money did I make in advertising today? Um, income today, wow. <laughs> We're now literally 250% of my train ticket sales. Oh, it's just advertising. That's amazing. I absolutely love it. So, yeah, bad shopping range is definitely still where we're getting absolutely slammed in terms of the score. So, that's something we'll need to bear in mind. Um, we may actually end up needing some utility, some more utility space in the future, which I guess is fine because we do kind of have this little area in here. Um, but for just now, uh, we'll just skip through to morning because nobody seems to be in a burn hurry to do something. Why have got two CCTV cameras in one little place? Get rid of that 
one, and then so we'll watch. Let's just like you get an idea of how ridiculous this is. So basically, for those of you who haven't seen this game before, uh, those little green bars that come up, that is somebody seeing an advert. And if five people see one advert, uh, then uh, you get 15 doers. And so you can just see, like, this is one train of 36 people leaving, and they're all walking past all of the adverts. And, like, oh, it's just, it is just an aggressive amount of money to be made by advertising. Uh, which is great, yeah. Um, right, so what we want, what we really want, We're gonna grab an indicator board here, and we're also gonna grab a level something map. Uh, where's map? Map! There's map. Perfect. Okay, so that's gonna help people feel happy. Cause I'm happy. Do, 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 do. Right. Uh, okay, these people aren't doing great, so let's, um, let us bippity boppity and expand upon this property. We're gonna sell all of this stuff, who's got a watering can? Mills, come and water this. Right this second. Oh, actually, you, you who's got nothing to do, oh, you come water this. So, by watering it, it means that I can sell it, and by selling it, it means I can start get some glorious stuff on the go. So I quite oh fuck. Right, hang on. I keep clicking things that I shouldn't. Uh, so I quite liked one of the designs that the game loading screen had. So let's try let's try and replicate it somewhat. Um, so I think we kind of probably want it here like this. Um, okay. So what we're gonna have is we're gonna have an indicator board. A, I think I want a light here, to be honest. Uh, we'll go for a level 3 map. We'll go for a bin. Actually, do you know what? I want to try something. I want to try... Uh, well, I guess. But by having lots of bins... I wonder if we can get away with using the level 2 stuff, because the level 2 stuff just looks better. It just looks so much better. Right, you. You with the flag. Yeah, like, see, see how nice and neat this stuff looks compared to the motherfucking bush of the century and fucking chode bin over here. <sighs> yeah, I think that's, I, I quite like that layout. But we almost forgot the most important thing, ornate clock. Yeah, okay, let's, so let's get rid of this one, and uh, who's got alert picker? You, Ahmed, pick up the bin. Let us go for what looks pretty, rather than what looks, or what, what has maximum stuff. Um, okay, right, so. Yeah. Yeah, so bad shopping range is definitely the last thing that we kind of, we have to get restored. Um, so I think we just skip clean through to morning. Um, and yeah. Well, the only thing for it, I, li I do like that the first train it gives, gives so much money. Because the other thing, I didn't actually know this until today because I never saw this. But people actually have to pay to leave your station. Um, as well as um, as not, as well as to get into it, and of course the re the reason for that is just because um, you know it's kind of a bit uh, a bit naff not having access to the um, 
Oh, hello. There's a big game on in a few days. Many drunken com commuters are here. Oh, well, oh, somebody's getting punched. Oh, damn, son. Not only is he getting punched, but... <laughs> yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Actually, I realized something. I just I just moved this with somebody inside. <laughs> uh, okay. When it comes to nighttime, we're going to make a quick staff-only passage to allow for people to get in and out a lot quicker. Right, okay, we're gonna, I think we need, I think, I think, I think we need more motherfucking tasers, do you know that? Um, so let's sort, um, so grab some more first aid, get a drip. Uh, let's get a crime desk here. And another fuck muffering taser. Um, okay. So let's just do, so um, litter pickers are good for as many people as possible to have. So let's have six of those. Uh, and then one, two, three, four, five. Uh, let's grab some assisty tabs. Um, some more toolkits. Uh, rat prods, I don't know if we really need more of those. Uh, litter pickers are fine. Let's get some. Yeah, we'll grab some more mops. I think. Um. Oh fuck! Hang on. I want everything to be in the right place. Uh, right. What are you? You're 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 a megaphone again. Um. Oh, do we have any mops at all? No? Yeah, let's get another rat prod. We just heard the squeak of a rat. Okay, cool. That should be us for, for tools for the moment. Um, yeah, so these bins don't carry as much, which is an issue. Oh, fuck, to toilets are a wee bit of an issue over here. to address that one in due course. Uh, you are feeling late. Which is a bit tragic. Um, right, let's sell this bench. Yeah, it's almost night time, so we'll wait until night time. Uh, so yeah, basically, uh, at the moment, any members of staff wanting to use the staff room have to go all the way up into this door, all the way back into this door, and it's just so much longer than it needs to be. Good, okay, I think we've got enough, enough equipment now to make everything nice and happy. Last train of the night's just pulled on in with its 13 beans. And it's got plenty of time for them all to get out, which is great because that basically means that they're all going to uh, come past all of the advertising hordes, which I absolutely love. <sighs> Delightful. Great, okay, so it's night time now. Um, so let's now open up this passageway here. Uh, and if we put a staff only do zone in here, Oh, that's that one. Um, I think there is space. Another cheeky bit of advertising. Glee! Wee! Um, right. Uh, okay, let's use... So, like, before we start opening up the shopping area, I think we need to address one of the obvious issues with the station. Uh, so far, and that really is the lack of seating. Um, so, level 2 bin. Chair, gap, chair, plant, chair, gap, chair, bin. Chair, gap, chair, plant, chair. <laughs> okay, fine, sorted. Uh, actually, hmm, I wonder if perhaps not. Uh, let's do level 2 plant. So, chair, gap, chair, bin. So that means we move this by one, and that gives us space for our first item of commerce. Actual commerce, not a not advertising. I'm gonna get a newspaper stand. Woo, let's go. Okay, um, right, so let's go for the nice and neat plants. 
which would be a level two. What's a level one plan? No, it's just a pushing up pot. Uh, one, two, three, and there, and yeah, that's fine. All right, luxury bench. So now that we've got the um, the advertising kind of hellscape, we're kind of less pu less pushed for uh, advertising space. Just trying to get that back in place. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I've got a good amount of commerce. Need more tools, megaphones. Oh, oh, well, that person got tased already. Jesus Christ, station's barely, barely been open. And that person just got absolutely full scent. Oh, yes, yeah, just hearing the noise of all the money that we're making. Amazing. So, yeah, so I think we've got the foundations to a nice little station on the go here. Uh, I think we're making creative use of space. Because, like, initially, it's, it's, it's really easy to, like, have the entire, uh, like, use, want to use the entire, like, length of the thing. But actually, even with everything unlocked, you're still limited to six, um, by the way, have we not unlocked something? I'm just thinking because it still says I've got five procurement tokens, even though there's nothing to spend it on. Hey, Wiggle, how's it going? Uh, yeah, um, ah, no problem. I don't know. I don't know at which point you left, but look, we've got the foundations. A nice little, nice little station on the go. Um, yeah, we're just about to uh, start turning it into a shopping center. <laughs> uh, right, one, two, th so uh, one, two, three, bin, one, two, three, plant, and then there's space either side. Okay. So, let's sell all this. Uh, okay. Uh, so we do this, and this, and this, and this. Perfect. Um, right, okay. So, uh, we'll get a plant. A bin, a bin, and we'll get another piece of commerce for today, which will be a fruit and vegetable stall. Perfect. Um, let's go ahead and grab some of the advertising that we replaced. Um, yeah, once once we start getting the sales up and running, we do become less uh, less dependent on advertising. But for just now, the fact that we are making. Uh, yeah, still, still twice as much through um, advertising as we are in train ticket t t train ticket sales is what is uh, our absolute godsend. Uh, yeah, had a call that one of my patients tested positive for COVID, so I have to go get a test done and uh, make sure I can go into work tomorrow. Kind of a rush to get it done. I oh, know, sorry to hear that. <laughs> yeah, I'm lucky that. Um, for the most part, most of my patients, I mean, I know most of my patients have COVID, uh, but they are kept behind a massive uh, fence. <laughs> well, it's not a massive fence, but um, my the front comport compartment of my ambulance is hermetically sealed from the rear compartment. So, um, yeah, we don't we don't actually have to wear masks when we have patients on board because there's literally no way for the air from them to get to the other one, uh, to get into the other compartment. We still usually do just by virtue of the fact that it's um, it's uh, it, it reassures them a bit more and it's easier than having to try and explain. Oh, you know, it's it's sealed between your compartment. I just wear a mask. I can't be bothered explaining it every single patient that I get. Um, so yeah, I just, I just wear the mask. Obviously when we're out and about, of course, we have to wear masks, but um, yeah, when we're in the vehicle. Technically not. Uh, right, let's go ahead and ingest some advertising. Perfect. Sorted. Uh, right, so we've still got a ton of money left over. So the station is starting to look pretty neat, which is pretty good. Uh, so let's try and use this extra dealer that we've got. 
uh, to really open up this space here, which we've now done. That sold a whole load of the advertising, which is unfortunate. Uh, but yeah, this is going to be our commerce hall. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab a level three light. And now we can start having a think about what commerce we want. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and space for one, two. So that's a pretty good fit that we've got there. Um, let's try and, we're probably gonna have to wait until morning for this one. Uh, let's just reset our advertising, which kind of dropped off the face of the earth. Okay, uh, I work in a mental health institution, so depending on the state of minds, uh, we have to be pretty close at all times. Yeah, I know um, I know somebody who uh, works in a mental health hospital and she's, you know, has a rough time with, with everything as well. I kind of, I can, I can get that feel, uh, unfortunately, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm lucky that, uh, you know, in my voluntary role, um, we are very strictly hands-off patients, so there is just, you know, there is very, unless there, unless there is some very unexpected emergency that we have to deal with, that we actually have to step out and go face to face, um, we have, um, you know, we're, we're, we're safe, we don't have to interact, but obviously that's not as easy when you're in, you know, your position. <laughs> Uh, right, let's give you some stamina, and, oh yeah, uh, probably a good idea to get a map in here. Um, actually, yeah, hmm, no, nah, we'll, we'll, we'll start the mapping and stuff uh, shortly. Uh, I wish, yeah, I'm just suddenly thinking, like, I really do wish that there was, like, a copy-paste tool somewhere, but there isn't, so... Kind of not ideal. Uh, right, so I think it's time to really start breaking out the commerce. And uh, the closest thing to people should definitely be the pub. Um, we'll slap in a chicken shop and a pharmacy. Uh, we'll grab a kiosk. Over the far side, we'll. Oh, how are we doing for power? How are we doing for power? Powers? Yeah, okay, fine. We're only using half of what we need. Um, if we grab a. Uh, so we'll grab a burger stall and a boot shop. Perfect. Uh, so we then need the rest of our schnuff. Uh, which will consist of um, all of the amenities that you can desire. Uh, so if we grab a flower stall, a hot dog stand, a coffee cart, grab two sets of turlets, Have enough money for those. Uh, right, so this back wall will just be our kind of concourse type thing. Um, right, so smack one of these in here, smack one of these in here. Sorted. So we've got toilets, we've got commerce. So commerce was the thing that we were missing from this um, from this here train station. Um, and so that has now been resolved in one massive swoop. <laughs> Uh, actually, I wonder if we maybe just move the toilets on this onto this back wall here. So I'm pretty sure there's somebody in those. So six percent reputation penalty. Wow, that's a lot of reputation penalty. Uh, right. Um, so yeah. So because this is going to be the main kind of commerce area, uh, we'll just get as much as we can in there. Uh, what we need. Is, let's go back to commerce. We're going to take a fruit and veg stall and a newspaper seller. Um, where's the newspaper seller? There we go, newspaper seller. Uh, and we'll grab two cash machines.
Okay. Um, I think we'll grab some vending machines here for the people that perhaps don't want to use the shops. But I think in terms of raw commerce, that is pretty good. Hey, Jones, leveled up again. You're getting closer and closer to your last level, son. As are you, everyone else, I believe, is already in their max levels. Look at that. Cool. Great, so we've got enough tools for things to be done. And I think this now lets us open up this last gate. Because what we were really missing was um, the commerce. And now that we've got the commerce sorted, if I go to the reputation today, you can see that you can see that we're not really missing much. So yeah, we are in a pretty Gucci position. Um, yeah. okay. I think we probably want to. a bit here. Um, Alright, let's just move you up. Move that light up. Perfect. Um, okay, so... How much is a pond? £150 for a pond?! My god, that's not very... Not very much at all! Um, okay, so what we're going to do is we're just going to fast forward until Marlin, just because I'm going to need a wee bit more cash flow on the go. How are we doing for our footfall bonus, by the way? So you're at the transit target, which is fine. Uh, you are almost at your transit target, which is fine. You've got a bounty on your head, so somebody's going to come and tase your ass. A body! Oh, there is a body. Big yanks. Aw, our Buckingham Palace guard's not got a taser. That's sad. Um, yeah, so the map is really what we were looking for here. So let's get an indicator board. Um, we'll grab that one here along with a level 3 map. Uh, we'll grab... So we're probably going to start losing a fair bit to litter soon. We're just going to have to keep that one in mind. Uh, we'll grab a little couple of luxury benches. Uh, just because we've got a lot of spaces open uh, that don't currently have any... Um, they, they don't have any uh, bins next to them. So, you know, we're just going to have to be conscious of that one. Cool. So we've got lots of toilet space. Perfect. Great. Um, so now that we've got a lot of this sorted, we can replenish um, some of our advertising. So basically, the game, the way this game works, or the way this game should be played, uh, is that uh, any space that you are not using for anything should be absolutely rammed to the brim with adverts, and if it's not, you're doing it wrong. So basically, what <laughs> what we've done, right, is that we have made a shopping mall inside a train station, um, and it's it's I'm I'm all about that. <laughs> ah, perfect! Look at it. It's ah, great. Oh, hello! That pickpocket noises. There's pickpocket noises. <laughs> Oh, there we go. He's been caught. He's been caught by our trusty CCTV camera. So our guard is going to go in and give him what for. What for indeed. And oh my god, we have so much. Like... Ah, we're making so much money. Um, right, let's go ahead and expand this. Here, let's go. Probably this one. Perfect. Uh, okay, so it looks like we're going to need one more light on the go. Is that fine? That scenario is over. Okay, 
Uh, this space here is never not going to be used for uh, copious amounts of advertising. So let's just start this nice and early by getting that nice and filled up. I wish there was a way of just like auto rotating through the uh, the adverts, so you don't have to keep clicking it. But maybe perhaps the game designers didn't intend for them to be so brutally overused as um, as I as I do. But where's the fun in not having a metric fuck ton of money? <laughs> I just saw one of the um, one of the icons for somebody who's just been pickpocketed, and it's just yoink. <laughs> oh, it's amazing! I've never seen that before. I've seen so much stuff I haven't seen before today, which is pretty alright. Um, okay, I think we can do it with the camera down here because this may this main thoroughfare we're gonna have to like keep majorly on top of. Um, Right. Oh goody, it's night time. Um, okay, so, uh, what we want, we want a pond in between there, um, reputation is 100%, absolutely banging. Uh, right, so one, two, one, two, here, one, two, one, two, uh, here, 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 yeah, there, okay, fine. Um, right, so, uh, let's just go ahead and slap that stuff, so we're gonna try and do them. Diagonally opposite each other. So yeah, I quite like the- oh fuck, uh, fuck that right off. Um, I quite like this, the, the little desi design of having all of this stuff. Um, so I saw this on the, um, uh, the, what's my jigger at? Level. Um, Um, yeah, so I saw, um, I saw this on one of the loading screens that came up, uh, and I thought it was a pretty cool design, so I figured I would try and replicate it, and, uh, yeah, it's quite a quite cool little design, I think. Um, slap a wee busker in here, and then a statue, and then all of the free space that is left, and oh boy, is there a lot of free space. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, hang on, apparently... Filling this advertising wall this early it was not a plan of the good variety. I love how when people arrive, they're just like making an instant beeline straight for the shops. Ah, oh, jeez, great! It's going to be like what the UK population is like when the COVID lockdown ends. <laughs> Okay, so now that all these benches are slapped down in appropriate positions, we can replace the adverts that we deleted. So the more money we start making, the better. Well, actually, we're not. We're, I think, to, to be honest, we're kind of almost in the dying, uh, the the dying stages of this uh, this this here train station um, design. Um, because there's not really going to be a great deal left other than um, to do a kind of similar s shopping setup over here. Um, and yeah. So if we have a look at our objectives. Oh, I've got to build an alarm. Hmm. Don't know why we would ever want to use an alarm. But fuck it, I'm game. Let's build an alarm. Uh, facilities level one alarm. That there, yeah, 500 dollar. Let's go. And so yeah, all right, perfect. So we've got a great setup on the go. Uh, right, we'll get a couple more benches done, and then I think we're probably going to call the stream there um, because it's getting pretty close to my dinner time. Um, right. So if 
think we probably want to have... Um... Right. Uh, is that going to work? Or is that going to be too clustered? I think that's probably going to be a wee bit too... planning to do with that one. Um, right, so we'll slap two bins. One here. And one here. Uh, and we'll sort some benches. Actually, hang on. I wonder if we can have like a just like a water feature. Um, let's. Your eyebrows have a reputation penalty. Go away. Okay, so we're gonna take a little bit of a hit for that one, and then if we just do ponds. Everywhere. Look at that. What a great little, you know, water feature <laughs> in the middle of a busy ass train station. Woo! Uh, okay. So this then gives us a little bit of wiggle room here to just do some back to back benching. Okay, perfect. That's about as much as we want to do there. Uh, and then similarly, we'll just go for another little. Okay, fine. So I think that is this area done um, as much as we can. We this is a this is an this is an incredibly busy train station. Oh my god! Right. So when we come back to Overcrowd, uh, and I think I'm probably going to stop. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to stop trying the flight simulator until I can get a new graphics card. It's going to take a long time for it to come, but uh, once I eventually get a new graphics card. Uh, fingers crossed. Um, yeah, it should be a lot better. Uh, so when we come back to Overcrowd, we will be um, sorting the last little bit in this station, which we, I imagine we'll probably be able to get done within the first, like, 60 seconds of um, of this uh, of this thing. Ah, right, how's our, what's our advertising count? Uh, summary. Money today. Good, so sales are now above adverts. Woo, we did it. We're living the dream. Look at that. Perfect. Um, so I think, yeah, actually, hang on. Before I forget, um, we could do with more megaphones. So megaphones are good at reducing uh, overcrowding. Uh, so we get more tickets. Um, litter pickers. I'm trying to think of what else we could need. Uh, watering cans is the last thing that we're kind of in need of. Um, water, 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 cans. Hmm. Uh, right, okay, yeah, watering cans. Fine, so that's probably about as much stuff as we can get. Um, actually, I wonder if we do not get more watering cans. Uh, right, okay, fine. So that should now help us get this stuff sorted. Our train station is starting to look pretty damn tasty, to be fair. So this is a great time to leave this and go pick somebody to um, to read. Uh, let's bring up the stream a boy boy. Uh, right, who was the last person who we raided? It's been a good couple of weeks since we've done a good old rage. A, ra a rage? A rage! Um, it's been a good while since we've done a rage on um, Edinburgh Fudge. So I think 
We're gonna go say hi to him. So yeah, sorry. I'm so sorry. This this stream today has been um, a bit of a uh, disaster, um, but. I am glad that we're finally able to get uh, up and running properly playing Overcrowd. It just goes to show you I should stop trying to do anything that's not Overcrowd. <laughs> um, but yeah, we finally got that sorted and had a good stream, which is great. Um, I will be back on Tuesday for some Fall Guys action, checking out uh, some more um, of Season 3 shenaniganry. So I, I look forward to seeing you then. But for just now, I'm going to say thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye!